Hi guys, this is Techzilla. I'm back again with another quick video. This time I'm going to be looking at the Samsung wireless charger, uh, the convertible one, the new 2017 one. It's got the fast charging technology built into it. Um, and as you can see, I've already got the cases lined up. So I'll be reviewing those as well. So if you want to see that, definitely hit that subscribe button. That will be up here somewhere at the end of the video. And I'll also leave a link to Samsung's last fast wireless charger. So you can check out my review of this one as well. And as usual, I'll be leaving links in the description below where you can pick this up from at a cheaper price. Cost me around 50, 52 pounds, which is not bad. Normally it's about 70 pounds. So let's get on with it. As you can see on the packaging, it says faster charging technology. 10 minute charge will give you 120 minutes of talk time, 60 minutes of video playback, and 50 minutes of texting. How true that is, I don't know. But there's your Samsung logo there. That's the back of the packaging. So if you want to read that, pause it, read it yourself. So let's open this up. You don't get the power brick with it. You're supposed to use the one that comes with your phone. So what do you get in the packaging? You get the quick start guide, which no one's gonna read. And you get this little adapter. I think that converts it from a micro USB, micro USB to USB type C. So you can use your old chargers. So let's get this out of the way. Now, Let's have a look around this first. The top, it's got this kind of leathery, quite a nice sort of tactile coating. It's like a fake leather. You've got fast charge written there. So you can tell the phone will be will grip tight nicely on there when it's charging. There's your type C charging port right there. There's the vents for the actual fan that's built in. There's a charging light right there. Reason it has the fans is to keep this cool and the phone cool while it's charging. Now, I know a lot of you out there are gonna go, oh, what's the point? You have to plug it in. I don't see why you should have to do that. Blah, 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 blah. Well, the reason behind it is if you work on a desk and you want to charge your phone up without having to keep plugging it in, plugging it out, and just keep it generally topped up, this is a good solution. I, I swear by these, I use them all the time. It's also good on your bedside table um, because it puts less pressure on the battery. So the battery should last, last longer. Yes, I know if you use a wire, it will charge the phone quicker, but you know, it is what it, exactly what it is. The bottom here, you've got this. Let's take this off. I've got a bit of a cold, guys. So let's take this off right here. You've got this like rubber base. So when it's placed on the table, it's not going to slip around. Nice and solid. So if we open this up, you can slide open like that. And you can tilt it up like this. So you can see that right there. You've got this rubber like material here. That will grip your phone nicely, stop it sliding around. And there's the actual mechanism itself. So you can actually use this in two ways. You can have it this way. So you can put your phone straight on the top and charge it flat. Or you can have it like that if you're on a desk like me and have your phone facing you. Let's bring in the old one from last year and compare sizes. So this is a little bit bigger, you can see right there. Um, difference is, it's a lot easier to find the sweet spot with this one than with this one. Um, this one's got the rubber ring around the sides and it's hard plastic in the center. And you've got your charging light there. And this is a micro USB, not a type C. It's got the fan there as well. Um, they both charge at the same speed in case you're wondering. Um, and also this one does not fall down. So it's solid like that. So if you want to take this with you on your travels, it's less compact than this. 
So let's plug this in right now and I'll give you a look at it. There's the lights flashing through to say that it's on. Let's close this down, the convertible part. So I've got my S7 Edge right here. Let's drop that on there to charge, see what happens. And there we go. It started charging. So you can see the light, the LED light there showing it's charging. And charging wirelessly, 59% approximately one hour, 28 minutes until fully charged. You can see the LED right there. So that gives you a nice idea. Now let's take this off. Let's incline it. Drop this on there. And bear in mind, I've got a case on this phone, so it's working nicely with a case. Again, it's got its fast charging. If you want to know the sort of numbers of how fast this will actually charge up an S7 Edge, um, I'll leave a link somewhere here at the end of the video for my review I did of this charger last year um, because these will charge at the same speed. Um, the fast charging capability only works with Samsung devices, certain Samsung devices. So if you've got another device like an LG G6, it will work on here, but it will not fast charge. So I'll leave a link for this video. In there, I'll tell you about the times it took to charge the S7 Edge. When my S8 Plus comes in, I'll be doing tests on this as well. So any questions, let me know in the comments below. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. Definitely subscribe right there because next I'll be reviewing these official cases of the Alcantara, I've got the silicone case, I've got the Clearview standing cover and the clear cover. So anyway guys, this is Techzilla saying take care and I'll see you all again real soon. Bye for now.